Beat. B roll. Beat roll. Beat roll. Easy guys. What we could do is we could arrange, arrange a rent back. What we do is we close on your house, we put the cash in your pocket, and then we rent back from the buyers that are going to be purchasing your home. Up to 60 days. Yeah, you pay them daily rent. And you just pay them a fair market value. Even if it's a little bit below fair market value, basically you ask them what their mortgage payment is. Let's just say their mortgage payment is $2,000. Divide that by 30, so you're going to pay them that for as many days as you want to stay there. Contract states you can do a rent back up to 60 days, but however, most average rent backs are between three weeks, four weeks. I would say up to 30 days is average. Uh, a little bit less. People are, uh, people are more apt to double move now. Uh, the reason is because when the market is solid, when the market is hot, the buyers are willing to rent back more. And when the market slows down a little bit, the sellers would like to just sell and they, they don't have any issues going to temporary housing. On a current deal that we're working with right now, in a typical situation that uh, clients that I'm working with currently, they would ask typically for a rent back in the position that they're in. And they've got quite a bit of furniture to move. They've got to do a double move. And what they would do is we'd sell their house, we'd rent it back, then they would purchase a new one, they would move in. However, in today's marketplace, when the homes aren't moving as fast as they used to, they're like, hey guys, we'll just make it work. We'll put our stuff into pods, we'll make it work. We'll get a sold, we'll move into temporary housing, extend a stay, then purchase the new home. We have to explain it to them. Because the news is, the media is always about six months lagging behind the real market. Because when you have your boots on the ground, you know what the real market is like every single day. But once the consumer hears on the media, that's when they believe the market is changing. If you have multiple, if you have multiple offers, you have obviously supply and demand here. Mm -hmm. If you have multiple offers, the chances of getting a rent back are very good. Plus, the chances of getting a free rent back are good if you have multiple offers.